Birds have some amazing abilities, like the ability to fly, or the ability to keep warm in snow. So it's no surprise that humans are trying to copy these abilities with our technology. Let's look at which ideas humans have borrowed from birds. For thousands of years, people have been trying to copy a bird's ability to fly. But the first people to achieve powered flight did so by closely observing birds. Orville and Wilbur Wright noticed that bird wings are curved and copied this basic shape. Even modern airplanes copy this bird-inspired shape because it is so efficient for flying. But the Wright brothers borrowed another bit of inspiration from birds. They learned to steer their plane by watching vultures. Vultures twist their wing shape to turn, and the Wright brothers rigged their flyer's wings to twist as well. With the combination of the right wing shape and the ability to steer, Orville and Wilbur Wright gave us the ability to join birds in flight. Birds have inspired other technology as well. In Japan, the Shinkansen high-speed bullet trains could travel up to 200 miles per hour. At this speed, trains would cause an annoying sonic boom when going in or out of a tunnel. So designers turned to the kingfisher, a bird which is able to smoothly dive into water. They copied its long beak by extending the nose cone of the trains. Trains could now avoid sonic booms and got increased fuel efficiency at the same time. And there is a technology that humans more literally take from birds. Feathers are so good at insulation that mountain climbers still choose down feather filled jackets to keep themselves warm. Synthetic fill, even with modern technology, is not able to match the warmth versus weight of down feathers. And the current frontier of synthetic jackets is to develop bundles of fibers that act more like feathers. Birds routinely make structures that we cannot copy, even with our best technology. There are several future technologies which are being inspired by birds. There is research into having airplanes fly together to conserve energy, just like a V of migrating birds. And scientists are looking at bird feathers to make artificial structural colors, which are non-toxic and do not fade over time. Expect more of the technology you use in the future to be inspired by birds. Thanks for learning this week. You can learn more lessons from birds by watching another video on this channel. And you can subscribe to see the future of bird videos. Thanks for stopping by this week to learn what makes life awesome.